A pro-Israel group celebrated Shabbat this evening, just yards from the UC San Diego Gaza Solidarity Encampment. Students in the group say they feel unsafe on campus, but students and professors in the encampment, which is in its third day now, say they are focused on peace and the liberation of the Palestinian people. CBS 8's Anna Laurel is live at UC San Diego with what's happening right now. Anna? You guys, it's really peaceful out here tonight. Some of the protesters are actually watching a movie over in the lawn. But peaceful is how protesters say they want to keep it. They want the university to hear them. They say they want the school to not use their tuition dollars to support Israel. But for some Jewish students I spoke with out here tonight, they say they feel personally attacked. A Jewish student organization held a Shabbat service tonight just yards from the Gaza Solidarity Encampment at UC San Diego. We normally do it all around campus. Tonight we decided that with everything going on, we want to really show that the Jewish community is united and we're proud and we're here. In the crowd full of kafiyas near the protest and encampment, an Israeli flag. We don't want anything but peace. We don't want anything but dialogue. We just want to have our voices heard. Jacob Rendler is in his third year at UC San Diego. He says he and his Jewish friends feel threatened. He's he says he supports free speech and people's right to protest, but the college protests go too far. You will have people push the boundaries well beyond what ex what's acceptable even at a public university. Yes, you have free speech, but hate speech is not protected speech. But what's going on on campus is inextricably shown to be anti-Semitism. We should never conflate anti-Semitism, which is a hatred against the Jewish people, which I am a part of, and protest against the policies of a state, which is Israel. Those are different things. We are protesting the senseless slaughter, murder, and carnage of the Palestinians in Gaza. Gary Fields has been a professor at UC San Diego for 22 years. He says he and other protesters want the school to cut ties with Israel and any company doing business with Israel or profiting from the war in Gaza. He says the Gaza Solidarity Encampment is the most disciplined and peaceful protest he's ever seen here, even with very different sides just a few feet apart from each other, like we saw with two different Shabbat services tonight. This one hosts Hosted by Jewish Voice for Peace. We have rules in order to keep nonviolence and peaceful protests to not engage with counter protesters. We really want to make our message that we are peaceful, nonviolent. This is what we are for. Uh, we are for divestment. We are for the liberation of the Palestinian people. And that's how we want to keep it. Now, that woman with Jewish Voice for Peace, you saw that she's covered. She's got her sunglasses on. Um, she's masked up. She and a lot of protesters out here are covering themselves. They say if they get recognized, they're afraid they will be unsafe. Live out here at the Gaza Solidarity Encampments at UC San Diego, this is Anna Laurel for CBS 8. Guys. Anna, we're hearing from some of the students. What is the university saying about all of this going on on its campus? Well, they're saying that, look, UC Riverside says that they've just come to an agreement with their students that were protesting there. UC San Diego says that Riverside started those protests before the students did here. So they're just getting that conversation started. But they say that there is open dialogue going on right now.